All right, I'm going to read you something I wrote, okay? Okay. Boys, I need you to sit down. Justice, leave the CDs right here. We'll clean them up later. To here, don't worry about it. We'll get you some more Skittles later. But I need you guys not to move because Daddy needs to talk to you. But I need you to hurry up because Daddy has to go soon and I'm not sure what time or when I'll be back. To here, go to the bathroom. This may take a while. Justice, make sure all your toys are put away. To here, did you wash your hands? Okay, so they're clean. Good. Always keep your hands clean. There are a lot of dirty people out there who don't play fair and will say your hands are dirty. And some will ask them just to make sure that they're pure. And when they do, I want you to look them in the eye and put your hands up slowly and show them your hands are clean. And if you get scared because they're mean, it's okay to cry. Daddy has been scared too, but you keep looking them in their eyes. Don't look away. To hear, pay attention. Stop it. I need you to listen. Keep that candy in your pocket. Don't you reach in your pocket while they, while I talk to you. I'm sorry. Daddy is just a little upset. It's me. It's not you. I just need to do a better job at keeping my emotions in check because if I don't, how can I expect you to understand this even though you're only five and seven? Justice, go get your brother a band-aid. Don't run. Walk. Don't you ever run. You know people live underneath us. Justice, always know where your brother is in case you guys are ever outside playing and there's no one else there willing to patch up his wounds but you. And don't you leave his side. You stay. I don't care if he's cut, broken bones, pepper sprayed, or someone tells you to get up, you stay. I don't care what anyone says. And if you get scared because they're mean, it's okay to cry. Daddy has been scared too. As long as he can breathe, he'll be okay. You are his keeper, so keep band-aids. Because I need you to keep your brother safe in case daddy doesn't make it back before you go to bed but daddy will make it back but if for some reason daddy doesn't make it back you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna be like that ghost in scooby-doo with you except you won't be scared because i'm gonna play jokes and love on you and you can call me ghost daddy because you won't see me anymore but you'll always feel me okay and know the reason why you guys can't go out and play while daddy is away is because it isn't safe there are people out there who want to take your favorite toys and steal my batteries bad guys who look good monsters like the one in thriller who don't like to dance or run and think it's fun to break things that don't belong to them like the backs of your toys and don't fix them then the mommies get upset because they don't want their boys i mean toys broken they just want them to come home so at the end of the day we can put all of your toys away with nothing broken and no one hurt and in the morning all the boys can go to school and the daddies can go to work with their batteries still in their chest pumping with thousands of volts. And the only thing that dies are the batteries within your remotes. And daddy hopes you understand what I'm telling you. But at the same time, I don't. I just want you to take care of your toys so that you live long enough to grow out of them. What daddy is telling you is that there is a bullseye within your melanin and no Ninja Turtle shell is big enough to cover the target on your back. And it is just because you are black. But I want you to take pride in that. And I promise you... I will come home safe. I promise to stay safe. Woo. You alright? Yeah.